Hi guys, welcome to this vlog. I have never done a vlog before, so before you watch this, please no one come at me. In two months, I'm gonna be getting on a plane to India, but I don't just wanna go and come back and tell you about it, I wanna actually show you. So I'm gonna be doing a vlog, hopefully, when I'm out there. I didn't want to go out to India without doing a practice run. One thing to note before you start watching is right at the beginning, I'm so sorry about the quality of the video. It turns out Google Pixel 6 cameras do not do well in dark mode. So I'm glad that I learned that today. That's the whole point of doing a test run. Um, yeah, so let me know what you think. Happy viewing. Good morning, everyone. Happy January. I hope everyone's doing well. I'm looking forward to bringing you along on my day. And so the first thing I do is get in my car and head out to work. So let's go. Okay, we have arrived in work. I don't want it to snow today because we have to get a train later to Manchester. Yeah, so let's hope it's not going to keep snowing. But I'm going to go into work now. Obviously, I can't film in there, but I'm going to go into work and I'll see you guys later. Bye. So as you can see, the snow continued all morning. It was absolutely stunning, but very, very cold. And before long, it was time to get into my Uber and get two different trains to Manchester. Uh, here you can see Leeds train station just coming in there. Um, I always find Leeds station so beautiful. I don't know why. I know it's a train station, but I have always found it really pretty. We are very much going to skip over the fact that I nearly got on the wrong train. And then here we have the first glimpses of Manchester. I would definitely say that Manchester is closer to London than Leeds. You can see why influencers like Tommy Fury and Monty May Haig moved there. It was a really, really beautiful city. So in true Indian style, I got a biryani, garlic naan, and this really deceivingly spicy but yogurty raita, which was really tasty. Okay, I should probably be heading to bed round about now, but I've got so much work to do before lectures tomorrow. Thankfully though, I've got some berries to keep me going, so it's all good. <laughs> Wish me luck. Okay, it's the next day. I had a great sleep. Here are the breakfast views. I must say, this hotel is a beautiful place to stay in. They really pulled out all the stops here. They really went above and beyond to make sure that there was every single kind of breakfast available. I went for a yogurt pot with a mango compote, which inevitably ended up all over my trousers, but we won't talk about that. Hey guys, so my morning lectures are done. Um, first impressions of Manchester, um, there are some beautiful buildings like this Harry Potter-esque one behind me. So six hours of lectures down, two more to go. These residentials are really full on. There's lots to learn, but it's always great to spend time with my course mates and um, yeah, learn about health informatics. Okay, so it is the penultimate day in Manchester. I'm not going to lie to you guys. After today's lectures, my brain is an actual potato. We <laughs> learned a lot of stuff about health informatics today, which went way over my head. I stumbled across this absolutely stunning church on my lunch break. Honestly, the photos do not do it justice. It was absolutely gorgeous inside and had this weird shell bowl, which was kind of cool. Of course I finished the day off with a Nando's just to treat myself and on my way home I stumbled across this little Korean shop called Oseo and I reminisced over all the Korean foods that I used to eat back in the day with my Korean friends from school. It was really nice and then I headed back to my hotel for a well-deserved rest. Hey guys, so lectures are officially done. 18 hours of lectures over the course of three days. For my brain is an official potato. Um, yeah, I'm so glad that I did this experiment of vlogging the last three days. Apologies for the shambolic nature of this vlog. I look forward to bringing you guys along to my next adventure in India. Thank you so much for watching. Love you loads.